Smoke alarms and carbon monoxide detectors are essential safety items in every home. There are two types of smoke alarms. Optical sensors are less likely to give false alarms from things like kitchen steam and react more quickly to smoldering fires. Ionization sensors are pricier but are a lot better for hot or flaming fires. The best alarms include both type of sensors. Now place at least one detector on every level of your home. Close to bedrooms is important and be sure to remember your garage. Now rather than the typical beeping alert, some alarms come with voice alerts. Others use a wireless signal to communicate. When one alarm is activated, the others also sound. Carbon monoxide is an odorless, colorless gas emitted by stoves, heaters, and fireplaces. A carbon monoxide sensor is the only way to detect this dangerous poison. Standalone carbon monoxide detectors, they work fine, but I like the models that actually combine smoke and carbon monoxide detectors all in one unit. Smoke alarms in new construction are always hardwired, but if you're adding new alarms to an existing home, battery powered is the way to go. Now, whether the battery in your alarm is just for power or for backup, it's important to change them every six months. Detectors also wear out and should be replaced every 10 years. A good idea is to write the date you bought the alarm on the back of the unit, then you'll know when it needs to be replaced. Better yet, choose a detector with a 10-year lithium-ion battery. You never have to change the battery and after 10 years, you just replace the whole unit.